Hi, I'm Jill Colbert. I'm the Director of Children's Services at Together for Children. My name's Alia, I'm 17 and I play football every day, studying a BTEC course. Hi, I'm Tony Rhodes. I'm the Principal of Sunderland College. Hello, I'm Gemma Lowry. I'm the CEO of the Bradley Lowry Foundation. I'm Liz St. Louis. I'm the Assistant Director of Smart Cities for Sunderland City Council. I think the city will be a place where women can excel. So we're, I'm sitting in a building here that's been built and created and brought to life by men and women, by girls and boys, because many of our, our children at school actually had a part to play in, in having a say around what this building looked like. But, you know, we need to see more women in positions of power. We need to see more women in positions of influence, but that influence can exist in lots of different spheres and in lots of different ways. There's a lot more coverage on women's football now on TV. A lot more opportunities for women um, and even young girls now. I think it's gotten a lot better. I still don't believe it's where it should be, but it is certainly getting there. Even though we focus on women in engineering, there's still a further push to do. There still is more that we could do for um, to raise awareness for women going into STEM subjects, and that's why we're doing it now. But actually, there's the massive opportunities in engineering, civil engineering, chemical engineering, actually even just thinking about things in the future, net zero, how do we prepare women to go into the employment of the future. I think it's back to that belief. You know, the key message will be believe in yourself, believe in your ability. You know, I work in a tech field, I work in a male-dominated, you know, arena, but just believe in yourself and your own ability and you will thrive alongside all of your colleagues that work in this field. I think that you should never limit your own expectations. Actually, if you are dedicated and committed to something, it doesn't matter if you're female. Actually, being a woman in any career with the right motivation, you will succeed in what you want to do. I'm lucky. I, I've had women who've who stood next to me and said, you know, go on, you can do it and I'll be by your side if you need me. And I'd like to be by the side of other girls and women who perhaps don't understand their potential. Sometimes they're afraid of succeeding, we're afraid of trying, because do you know what, we might just do it. As a female, I would say an inspirational message would be, you can do anything you want. You're going to have bad days. You might have bad weeks. Just don't stop there. Get up the next day and try again. I was a mum at 18 year old and then I still went to university and got my degree at Sunderland University. Bradley was poorly. I was still very young when Bradley was poorly, but I still got up every day and I still fought for him. You can do whatever you want. You can have your bad days, but as long as you get up the next day and fight on.